EA Sports. It's in the game. Oh! Yeah! Oh, look! Oh, 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 Take it to the house! Room to run along the side. I think, uh, you know, Madden, when you think about the game, people think of uh, online play and kind of that one-on-one -on -one spirited competition, just very, very competitive. But last year, taking that step forward with the online co-op play, you know, that was, that was our first step. This year with online team play, I think it's taken it to a whole nother level and kind of making this notion that Madden can actually be a team sport now and be more about cooperative play versus just solo one-on-one. -on -one. Uh, this year, full three-on-three. Three. You know, it could be three guys on offense, two guys on offense against three guys on defense. Doesn't matter. It's up to three players on each team. Uh, headset support, of course, there, and it's it's a it's a blast. And it, the surprising thing is the fun part is is really the communication. I don't know what you saw or what you think you saw, but I pushed him out of bounds. And and the stuff that happens around the game of football makes the game a lot of fun to play. Playing cooperatively is, is just a different experience we've never offered. Um, the other sports games are seeing a lot of success with it and it seemed like a natural fit to support you know, three on three. There, there were a lot of design troubles and, and decisions that we had to make to go with three on three, um, really to make it less chaotic. So we had to you know, build a lot better experience around the squad that you control, the group of players that you control, and keep the numbers to a manageable level and so instead of having 11 on 11, which would just be mayhem. I think the, uh, you know, the squad-based thing is actually pretty cool for a couple reasons. One is the first one you talked about, which is it kind of limits the confusion that can happen if we're playing together and I switch off and I go somewhere that I didn't expect to go and it blows up the entire play. But the other part of it too is if you think about like superstar mode and some of the things that people liked about that, it's that I can specialize. If I just love being a wide receiver and I'm not really good at you know reading my going through my progression and being a quarterback, Phil can be the quarterback, I'd just be the wide receiver, and then that's it. Our team, I'm always the wide receiver. I'm always the secondary. So I think that's a cool element to it. It's a lot more ownership and, and a lot more kind of pride in, in yeah. knowing that, all right, I've got the linebackers and I'm really good at this and I'm going to handle it for the whole game. You don't have to worry about us. Go, Anthony. Short throw to the left. Oh, you're terrible. Oh, yeah. go, oh, yeah. go, that's go, go. That's how oh. I that's how oh. I Oh my god. I'm trying to tell you right now. For me, I think what one of the cool things of playing online obviously is just the, that ability to be able to, to perk up or to just have this sort of reason for coming back, right? Whether you're winning or losing, you still have fun and you still want to come back. Clearly playing with up to potentially five of your other friends is going to make that fun and, and competitive and cooperative. But this idea of I am a wide receiver and that's who I control and I'm trying to reach certain in-game performance goals so that as my, my unit, as I play with other people, it improves my ability and my ratings. I mean, do you guys think that's something that is really going to resonate well with that, with that crowd that's used to having that progression? Yeah, I think it's a must. If you're playing a team play game, you're controlling wide receivers. If you have 200 yards and three touchdowns, it's a big win for you and now you're going to be leveled up and better in that position whether you won or lost, you know, you had a good performance, you should be rewarded. And the idea is, right, that I, I take those ratings boosts that I get, I, I take those with me. So I might be playing a game with, with you three, and then, or you two, and then I go and play later with Phil. I get to take whatever performance boost that I earned mm -hmm. and bring that to our game. And so that is that specialist mentality. You're going to be getting ratings boost on the players you're controlling. You know, they're permanent. So every time you play, as soon as you get into a lobby with your friends, or, They'll see right away, wow, this guy's totally maxed out at the defensive back position. He's got that covered. We'll let him play that. Oh, he's got nothing at quarterback. I'll, I'll take that. You know? So that kind of stuff is immediately evident as soon as you get into a match with someone, too. So. Yeah, the aspect of you know, playing a team play game and having fun even when you lose, that's a real thing. It's more about just talking crap to each other that you were blowing. It. You know, it's not about this, like, oh, I wasted 30 minutes and I feel terrible. It, it's, you don't have that emotional impact anymore. You're just really like, oh, we'll, we'll brush it off. We're still a team. We'll get back together and do better next time. He gets another oh, carry. Geez. He found some daylight. That's not good. Oh, Where's our defensive back? Racing toward the end zone. Oh, oh they get to Anthony. That touchdown, Bengals. That, see? No. Give him a terrible. touchdown. Got to play your spot, Anthony. Team, Dude. online team play. I think it's a, it's obviously a overdue. We definitely needed it, and it's a huge help, a huge improvement to the game. He tries to scramble. Oh, Got him. oh, hit it, Got him. hit it, hit it! Touchdown! That's right. Yes. Touchdown. That's right. What did I tell you? What did I tell you? <laughs> That's marketing, son. That is how marketing does it. Madden NFL 11, August 10th, in stores everywhere. It's a wrap. Playing with Anthony is like playing with an eight-year-old.
It is. <laughs> like you're...